We have a few pieces of machinery in the plant from BE&E and we have a, a wood chipper that we bought for one of our facilities. And most recently we added in a uh, biomass uh, feeder bin. Biomass engineering equipment means to me the, the premier material handling equipment supplier in the nation. The best parts of the smart conveyor are the robust design. It's modular, quick to go together, quick to install. They're dust tight, they're energy efficient. It's gonna save them labor, it's gonna save them energy, it's going to save them maintenance. But we have had problems on other conveyors in the past that said they were gonna move so many cubic feet and when the conveyor loaded up, it did not want to handle said volume with a lot more horsepower than what the smart conveyors are using now. We have so many tools in our box that we can pull from. We have different models of conveyor, different sizes, different capabilities. In our bins, we've tried to find nice little sweet spots of sizes and output ranges. It's not just a fantastic machine solution, but you're getting a team of people that are, in my opinion, the best in the world at what they do every day. The engineering team was really easy to work with. You know, they pretty much just wanted to know how much material we wanted to move and the volume and the weight and how far we were going up and with it on the conveyors. And they sent us back numbers and everything looked good to us. And we wanted to ensure we had plenty extra room in our conveyor and they guaranteed it. And so far, everything's still standing strong. We kept seeing these drawings coming from engineering groups that we would then have to completely rework really to optimize them. And over time, we and the customer came to the conclusion, this is a lot of wasted time. What we want the customer to do now is come to us with the big picture. We want to move this many tons. It consists of this. We want to load it out this way, or we want to separate it and do this with this product and that. Give me a flow diagram and a vision of where we're going. Now let my team, with all their great experience and all the projects that they've done, go in the library, pick out all the pieces to get it done as efficiently as possible. Now design time is cut. Well, we see everything from sawmills is maybe our number one target. Wood pellet producers have become a huge customer for us and that's gonna to continue to grow. So anybody processing wood is a potential customer for us. But we've also done other materials as well, like grasses and corn stover, which is the residue left over in the field after harvest, ground rubber. So there's a lot of possibilities with different materials. Every sawmill, every pellet mill, every application we run into, they have their own unique layouts and designs and, and challenges. And, and we have to customize our equipment to fit that. The beauty of our conveyor and its modular design is it's very easy to do that. So we have five foot straight sections. So it's kind of like putting Lego blocks together. There's a great culture here of collaboration. Everything is talked about. That collaboration of bringing all those different backgrounds together and say, well, I saw this here and I saw that over there. And it's really great to see this group of people solving problems for so many different people around the country. We're there to help them. So we support them. If there is a problem, we're gonna be there to help them get through it. If it's their fault, we'll still help them get through it. If it's our fault, we're definitely gonna be there by their side to get it fixed and get it running correctly. You know, whenever we've had an issue, they've been quick to respond. You know, when we did have the initial startup, we had a couple issues in the first thing and they drove out from Indianapolis all the way here to Cincinnati and got things set up and so it's been, you know, within 24 hours notice, we either had someone on the ground or we had some kind of situation rolling, so that's great. They do a pretty good job explaining specifically what they offer, what they do. That's one of the reasons originally why when I called, I already had a sense of kind of how this was going to work. I wasn't going in blindly because I've been on their website, I'd looked at a lot of their materials, seen pictures, videos, photos, and through conversations with Dane, with a couple tweaks and engineering ideas, it came together and we were on the same page from day one. I mean, you have to have a great company with a great future to attract great people. And I'm surrounded with the best in the world. I stand back and say, Gosh, am I even needed here anymore? But the, if it runs every day without me being here, that's a good company.